right over to where our portions of the game is. We'll get it started. And we'll go from there. I also wanted to test an audio fix that I was working on as well. And doing research on the 3090s that seem to be coming into play. So. Alright, seems like everything's working out pretty good. We're almost loaded in. The ancient Greeks there believed that King Poseidon ruled the waters, whereas here at Prosperity Sands, they're ruled by luxury leisure groups international. He's right, but it's also ruled by me, a giant shark in the sea. So, let's go ahead and rock and roll with this. Oh, I forgot. Yeah, he got all mad. Boys in the whole region. He is that pissed off at me. Bad, Scaly Pete. Bad. I guess we could probably go check out the mission. Stay under the water though, just to make sure I don't trust these fishes. Tourism in the U.S. continues to grow, leaving millions of naive Americans vulnerable to the graft of beach umbrella rentals. Got it. Were sharks' palates more refined, they prepare their turtle meat with just a splash of amontillado. No, as soon as I got to go around to get that little bugger. to King Crush in the 2011 Monster Mania semifinals, Big Ben stepped away from the limelight for a simpler, more natural way of life. Just wanted to show him the fish could walk. Figured it would frighten anyone. can tell what may be found in a shark's stomach, it's truly the ocean's garbage. Hey, look, 
the license plate. scavengers, indiscriminately consuming anything that's vaguely edible. Not all of them, just the ma good majority of them. Disrupted the fragile equilibrium of the marine world. It's true. Got him. Lake plays host to the city's working poor, who come despite its frequent water quality alerts. I'm, I'm really confused. Like, I thought I would have gotten that. Maybe I had to bite it. Alright, let's try biting it. Any body of water saturated with sewage or slaughterhouse waste can be quite appealing to sharks. All right, last time. Champions. Human's record as a steward of our lakes and rivers has been checkered at best.
I seriously don't know how to open those. Those are like ridiculous. I'm gonna go to my grotto over here. Oh no, I can't. Okay. Well, I'll figure out a way to jump it. Oh, we're in a highly developed sharky here. Let's see, look at that. Coastal overdevelopment creates a riskier, more complex local environment. Port Clovis has gained a reputation for its derivative, politically confused street art. Still is. Maybe it's cutscene oriented or something better. The shark returns once again to her safe haven. Killing a sea turtle carries a criminal penalty of up to $100,000. But sharks are notoriously profligate when it comes to paying fines. It's very true.
shockingly, this was only Alex's second worst birthday. A perennial favorite among sport fishing enthusiasts, blue marlin generate tens of thousands in annual tourism revenue for Port Clovis. to explore the land, it's always best for sharks to stay wet and oxygenated. The shark should really get some water in her gills. This instantized protein makes a great between-meal supplement, giving the shark the energy she needs to put on serious meals. have exploded here. Bad news for seagrass, great news for orcas who enjoy torturing and eating them. Damn, that took a lot of skill. uses lipids from high-fat fare like this to help fuel her reign of terror. Man's tendency to anthropomorphize them into lovable cartoon characters belies the fact that sea turtles are ordinary creatures that can bite through bone.
random mutations aren't random. They require large amounts of mutagens as a catalyst. The bull shark is able to attain larger maximal sizes through selective feeding. playing with toys, but not half as much as a day-old seal carcass. Where the hell did I end up? Bull sharks have a habit gobbling up anything that finds its way into the water. close friends or family members who have been eaten or happy by sharks. They got their fish fingers. Good say I got a real keen eye for talent. Oh, the wheelers really got to work on those side areas. Not too bad. 
Slowly but surely, all these are potentially becoming mine. What are you waiting for? Humans' attention spans are short. They've already forgotten about the shark and her many crimes, so thus ends the bounty. From the moment she's born, the shark's cold, expressionless eyes are constantly on the watch for food. fish fingers, Casanita just wants her favorite comfort food, raw shark liver. Port Clovis City Council never misses an opportunity for cross-franchising. I thought I got that one last night. American the sea wolf remains acutely aware of anything that might constitute food. 
No one knows who built this mysterious underwater base, but odds are they probably own a Nehru jacket and a Persian cat. Supercharged with gene-altering mutagens, the shark now has an asymmetric edge on the competition. Fort Clovis has long been a popular dumping ground for the military, thanks to its lenient regulations and low tipping fees. <laughs> That's great. Solitary hunter stumbles upon another source of nourishment. This is quite a find. Although, that depends on the gold market, which has really been underperforming lately. I blame the Fed, of course, but what can you do? <laughs> the irony of his statement today, standard. Scavengers of the sea are vital in cleaning the ocean floors of edible and semi-edible detritus. Hunger is a driving force for the bull shark. Giant monsters, or kaiju, occasionally visit Port Clovis to pregame before destroying more worthwhile cities. I love this game. It continues to have just a crap load of movie references. I think we're going to fast travel, and the network has worked really well. So, I think I'm going to call it here, everyone.